Oh, my bad. I almost hit y'all. My bad, Saint Squad. What's the deal, Leo Martilio? It's your boy Josh Fry. I'm coming to y'all with another banger video. Now, let me just turn around because I'm not giving y'all the free game because y'all not finna little dirk me with Dior Savage. As soon as Dirk said that, everybody got Dior Savage. Y'all not doing that to me, but I will put. Nah, I'm not even gonna put y'all on this because they don't sponsor me. If they do, then we good. But, anyways, y'all, what's the deal, Leo Martilio, Saint Squad? I don't know why y'all just in the bathroom sitting here while I'm sitting here getting ready for the day. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. I guess you family. I guess y'all was probably taking the dookie in the toilet. I walked in on y'all. My bad. But I hope y'all having an amazing day, especially to my Naughty Gang, because you're watching this in the evening time. So I hope you're having a good day. Now, I hope you're eating good with your dinner that you eating for this video. Give me that. You know what I'm saying? I just took one of your chicken bones. We family. You got to see. You walk in the bathroom. If you sitting here in the bathroom, at least give me chicken bone. You know what I'm saying? Need that. But anyways, y'all, right now... I just got dressed. And then, right now, I'm in the tech fit. I'm in the OG tech fit. You know, the new tech fits got the little black that go right here. Now we OG. You know what I'm saying? OG Negro. You know what I'm saying? So, right now, we're wearing gray because it's a little cloudy outside. But right now, we also wearing gray because the hurricane is also gray. So, I decided today I might as well match the hurricane, right? You know what I'm saying? It is a good day, even though it is. I mean, it is a little wet on the ground and it is a little gloomy out, but uh, it is what it is. Just be appreciative for where you at and what you got. You know what I'm saying? Hallelujah. But, anyways, y'all, we are gonna be in a hurricane today because I mean, I think this is the last week of it actually being like decent now. It's like probably like 38, 40 degrees right now, y'all. But next week, it's supposed to literally go to like the low of like six, zero, negative one, like in the high of like 19, 20. You know, it's supposed to get cold next week. So we're gonna, just going to enjoy this weather because I am not driving the hurricane in that. Like the hurricane tweak out in 20 degrees. What you think it's going to do in six? I do not know, but white wheels is low key smacking. We just have the front of the bumper where, of course, they took like the front splitter off reflections they did a really good job wrapping it i just don't like all the primer that made it like impossible to get this extra wrap off but we're gonna go up to mc whips that is where we're going we're heading up to mc whips and we're about to see what mc whips can actually do about it because first of all we're getting a new windshield so we're gonna go to mc whips and set that all up get the new windshield get it retinted i want to get the windshield ppf this time y'all was telling me to do that thank y'all saint squad for the advice so i'm gonna do that and yeah and we're gonna see about the front bumper and see if we could get all this extra stuff off or maybe i should ask tino at next gen speed if we can get you know what i'm saying uh front bumper also with a back bumper i don't know saying squad we just got a lot to do so right now we are about to head up to mc whips and then after mc whips go up there talk to them yada yada then we are going to head up to vet lab performance lab to see the amg because i think they started on something yeah, if you just don't look close enough, you're not you're not gonna notice it, all right? It's okay, you won't notice it. I forgot how paint feel. We'll start. This car is almost at 70k miles, y'all. Ain't that crazy? By the time I'm done with the hurricane, it'll probably be. I'll give it 80 to 85k miles. And when it's time to sell her kind of 85k miles it's at 70 now how many miles do i think i'm gonna get to by the time it's time to sell the hurricane comment down below let me know but i'll give it 80 something k miles maybe that's what i'm thinking what do y'all think comment down below let me know i could probably sell it for at 80k miles i've seen them going for like 180 well, 190, like 190, 200, but that was when I got this. So it's probably going to be like 180, 170. So I said Hurricane for that. Hallelujah. <laughs> Anyways, now we on the way to MC Whips. You know, see what the Dilio Martilio is. So hopefully they can get time to like wash my car so I can actually see it clean. If not, I don't know. I'm just showing up. Got to see my boards at MC Whips. I haven't been there or seen them in a minute. And then we're going to see, check on the AMG because we got to update on that. So y'all, stay tuned. Smash the like button because this video, a banger. And y'all, we have made it to MC Whips. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? First of all, let's see. The guys probably haven't seen a gray in so long, so let's see if they remember it. It's mm. dirty right now, too. 
it's dirty right now. I low key like the gray off the white wheels, and then yeah, like, sir, gray with white wheels is harder. Yeah, but yeah, like all this, like I still got like this little like orange stuff. It took some of the bumper off right there, but whatever, it'll grow back. It'll grow back. Yeah, it'll grow back. It'll, it'll be alright. <laughs> but yeah, like all the little orange like stuff, I think it needs to be power washed or something off. Yeah. So, need I don't some know. Love. Yeah, need that bad. It's like stuck on there. They use like primer, right? For real. Yeah, they killed it. But it is what it is. Yeah, I'm getting new wrap so soon enough. Paint it pink. Paint it pink is nuts. I hate this car. Bro, let me tell you what happened this morning though, gang. What happened? God, I kind of pick up my car, text Max this morning, say, "Hey, I'm going to pick up the vet." He like, "Okay, cool." I kind of try to start my car. It ain't start. <laughs> I say, what, what? Jake got hooped. <laughs> like, what are y'all doing? Like, it's only been here for like oh, maybe two weeks. Mm. Low key, two weeks. I had to jump the car myself. Ugh. I like the fit, Jay. Appreciate it. What up? Gantian. Damn, bro, I got two cameras. Hey, that's how you do it. <laughs> you that's famous. You got bombarded. <laughs> Man, I got Jay, I ain't seen a vet in a minute. Let me yeah, look at it. it. You can have it. I can have it? You can have it. Here, Thanks, take Jay. the key. Right I love, see that? It's Same squad. Cool. Make sure y'all get rich friends. Look at the vet. Jay, we like the vet. Who was we? Me and Saint Squad. Saint Squad has not, never commented and was like, ooh, Jay, keep the vet. He said nobody. Uh, <laughs> exactly. Don't y'all like the vet though? I love the yellow. I don't. I'm done with this. You don't? City fan, you already know I'm done with this car, bro. This car has given me such a headache, bro. And, and it really, to be honest with you, anybody else that had this car would be like, nothing's wrong with it. But for me, I can't do it no more. Wow. I'm done with it. That's crazy. And I love my Corvette. Ask your at, at MC Whips. Jay came also. And there's a reason why Jay is up here at MC Whips also. Yo, I'm, I'm going to just let Jay explain this to y'all. Look at Jay holding Damn, the door Josh for me. Cold. You're right. It is cold. You don't want to go look <laughs> at it. I'm scared to look at it. <laughs> He's scared to look at it. <laughs> this hard. I like this green. Hold Can on. we? Let's go look at it, Jay. Josh, you ready to see the G3? Yeah. I'm I scared am. to see it. All right, come on. This is why Jay up here. Literally. Oh man! Hey. It's a fart holder. It's a fart holder. What Look happened? This, bro. What happened? Yeah. So what happened was I was driving, and then you know the car gremlin came out, got my wheels, I hit the rails, and then the bumper messed up. The, the what came out? It's a car gremlin. You know when you're driving and nothing really happened, you're like, what happened? It's a car gremlin. Yeah, it's not you. It's, it's a car gremlin. Jay ran into a cone. <laughs> <laughs> Jay ran into y'all know the construction cones. It was it was cold outside and snowy or icy or it whatever. Was, it was it was low key snowy, but it wasn't that bad. I was just curious to see what that side looked like. Yeah, because that's the side that really got messed up. But I mean, nothing, nothing else on the car is messed up. He looked like he got all the parts though. That's the frame for the bumper. That's probably the uh, the bumper over here somewhere. I think that's where he moved over there. He like he got most of the parts though. Dang, GT3 back, need that. I, man, I've been waiting on this boy. But I can't even look. They got a light, the headlight, look. Oh, that's a headlight? Yeah, because the headlight crack. I was watching this one dude who built the uh, GT3 in uh, 24 hours. I watched that video. You watched that? It was a good video. He yeah. wrapped it and everything. Uh -huh. Yeah, it was good. Dang, everybody watched that, huh? Same squad, y'all know what I'm talking about? Comment down below let me know. But yeah, if y'all were wondering what, what happened to JGT3. Y'all already know. Josh don't know. He ain't seen this yet. This all I messed up right here. This the front bumper? Yeah. Yeah. Where the new one? They got the new one. That's what I'm saying. They got put it on. Oh yeah. I don't know where it's at though. Yeah. yeah I don't know. I gotta look but if y'all was wondering what happened to J Car, uh, yeah, it is here at MC Whip. So if you do get Snickerdoodle or whatever. And you in Michigan, come to MC Whips and they get you right, okay? Understand that. MC Whips is probably the best in Michigan to deal with, so just come to the best. I'm putting y'all on. Free game. One of those things where it's basically like K use the same thing that MC Whips will use, but it's one of those things where you have to actually like take your time and actually do it. So when we get the rewrap is when I'm pretty sure because the bumper, they took the bumper off to do it. As you can see, it's wrapped so stuck and tucked into there so k is going literally when they wrap it they going to take the bumper off everything and all of that will be gone but for now we just gonna have to deal with it which isn't bad it's still lambo and i'm still grateful for it so thank you lord for giving me this so we gucci and the coochie on that and 
I might do Black Will Saints, but I might have MC Whips painting black. Here, leaving MC Whips. Major shout out to MC Whips, man. Literally, you get Snickerdoodle, you need some tent, you need some PPF, whatever. MC Whips got you, Motor City Whips got you, man. So make sure you come up here. They literally the best in the city. I was talking to Johnny about the wheels, and I was like, yeah, I think I want to go black. But the thing with black is, okay, Saint Squad, listen, we in the winter. And Johnny said we should paint them. We should paint the wheels once it gets warmer out because it still takes 90 days for the paint to actually harden on the rim and then we got salt and everything so the salt will mess the rims up and all that stuff so we basically gonna wait but anyways y'all right now we are headed up to performance lab actually i should do a old three-point turn but right now y'all we are headed up to performance lab to check on the big amg man and somebody said somebody commented down below and was like josh this like last video somebody said this video boring all you did the whole video was unwrap the car well that's what the title is what you want from me because now if i had dropped the video where i only put the title and thumbnail in the first 10 seconds y'all be like the title and thumbnail only in the first 10 seconds this clickbait like you just can't win and i don't even think my videos is boring like what do y'all think it, okay it'll be a few haters who sit here and probably watch people who only do hype stuff you know what I'm saying? Be like, oh, this video boring, whatever. Y'all, my videos is basically just lifestyle vlogs. I'm just vlogging my life, but it's around cars. That's how my videos always been. Like, yeah, some videos might be boring, but that's just because that day is boring. We just doing the update stuff. I always, like I always said, I'm going to always keep it real with y'all. Like, y'all watch these YouTubers who lives look like it's just like easy, simple. They get everything, which that's not what life is. God to give you struggles in your life to build you up to make you stronger not show you all my life and I show you all my struggles what I go through but that's what make it even better when I do overcome and we overcome together Saint squad because I wouldn't be here without y'all and the Lord I wouldn't be here without the Lord and y'all gotta switch that around make that put the Lord first you know so I'm grateful for where I am I'm thankful I'm grateful for the struggles and everything I'm grateful that I'm able to show you all that not only because not only because oh it's content but y'all will be able to learn from the struggles and learn from the downfalls and everything that i go through also so okay maybe we might have some boring chill days but y'all got to see that life is more than just being hype all the time and stuff y'all and the last video was a banger i unwrapped the hurricane that's a banger that's a big step you know what i'm saying so i don't think that video was boring then we was there with good friends and everything fire cinematics fire music i mean like it was hype you know what i'm saying i think that video was a banger y'all so comment down below let me know of course there'll probably be some a few haters but you can't please everybody a bunch of people hated jesus for no reason so i ain't tripping but yeah y'all it's just literally vlogging my life y'all as we go we just vlogging life that that's just what it is some days might be boring some days gonna be hype but it's just life man you can't be mad that that your life is a certain way you just got to change it you know what i'm saying saint squad so if you if your life born just change your life just i'm just thankful and yeah i just walk my life but it's around cars and every video is a banger man because it's always something to learn a banger don't mean hype and everything but a banger is something that it, it brings emotion and i think a video if you learn something in the video also i think that's a banger too no matter how simple it can be but i think it's just enjoyable if you're sitting there just enjoying going through life y'all literally in the passenger seat with me right now we just sitting here talking that's not boring so thank y'all saint squad keep sitting there keep watching smash like button if you haven't already we finna head up to performance lab look at ken calling me first jay came out now ken coming out Ken, Unc, where yeah. you at? I'm at performance lab. All right, I'm on my way. I'm waiting for this uh, lady to move. You know, it'd be tight here at MC Wits, but it's like, it, it's only 10 minutes away, so. Okay, well, I just got in here, so I'm here. All right, here I come. Okay. All right. How, why can they come to MC Whips with us? So, Jay came here, but Jay got to go to work, so Jay left. Now, Ken, at performance lab but see what Ken, Ken needed need to get out the bed y'all go y'all tell Ken get out the bed stop being lazy we everywhere made it oh my gosh that going in right there is so difficult where Ken at where Ken at how he here 
He already inside. Ken, Ken already inside. Ken said, I'm here. I'm inside. It's cold. I don't blame you, brother. Anyways, we have made it to Performance Lab. Take that off. Mm -mm -mm. So, y'all, basically, all this stuff, until I, like, just start pulling that in myself a little by little, all of this is going to stay. So, if you see it in person, don't look too close. And the white wheels are going to stay until it starts getting warm out or, or, for it's like have an extra pair sitting around that they want to send me. That's also another option as well. But let me lock my baby. It's not sexy if you don't look back at it. <laughs> you feel me? Why can't got an office? You know, I'll just keep getting jobs. <laughs> I know. KA fired you. Now you here. <laughs> look at that. I like this. We look the same. I know. We tech fit. Tech fit. <laughs> He's, yeah. got his, he's got his HQ office now. Right. right. Why? Oh, how you keep getting jobs? I don't know. <laughs> Let's walk through. Boom. Influencer hall. It smells straight like race gas. E85 in here, y'all. Yeah, Man, it felt like Antarctica. Can't even speak right. While we walked right in here, I walked straight past my car sitting right here. I did not know at all. It blend in. It do blend in. Black, black man. Ain't this the same gray as the Huracan though? This literally looked like the same gray. Look at this, the engine out. So we, we were just sitting in a meeting with Ed and we were just going over everything, going over the plan and everything. We got the full plan going down, but I just let me just give you an update on this. But first, before we do a full update, just look what they have in here. Taz took the thing off his car. He revealed the wrap. They said I leaked the wrap. <laughs> <laughs> they was in this comment saying, it's in Joshua on video, he leaked it. <laughs> My, my bad gang got get how you live. <laughs> my bad, bro, for real. But the AMG, the AMG is right here. And the update we do have on the AMG, which we start next week. So next week, we're going to get this thing on the hoist and actually get everything pulled out of here. You see, they took this cover off. This is literally, so look at this engine bay, okay? We are putting a Hellcat engine in here. And look at, the, you know what I'm saying? Look at this engine bay. Yeah. First of all, I don't know what happened to my tire liner. Why is the tire bald? I don't know. But you see how huge this engine bay is, and the front part is basically all coolant and just extra space for some air intakes for no reason. So we take that out. We do one air intake. The engine will probably sit up more, the Hellcat engine, but I don't know. We Actually, we're just going to go over it. I just want you all to see that a Hellcat engine can fit in here. I don't know if it's going to fit top high engine out the hood you know what i'm saying no. race car nope no hood no hood no hood no, no hood to be so fire we from the hood <laughs> <laughs> what's i <laughs> what's i <laughs> <laughs> what is going on <laughs> what ken what is going on what's I? <laughs> but so we doing no hood but yeah y'all next week the update on the amg we had our meeting everything next week the AMG will go under and we are taking everything out and seeing how everything will fit in here and all this stuff. So stay tuned for next week, Saint Squad. That's the update on the big AMG, on the AMG, on the Hellcat AMG because it's happening. And also there is a mock Hellcat engine here. So what we are doing is we're gonna take everything out. So like I just said, take everything out, see how it fits. And then we're gonna put the mock Hellcat engine in transients to see how it will look, how it will fit in here and everything. So. We basically going to see how it's going to look at the end. And the transfer dude been ducking me on this, bro. Uh, yeah, he been ducking me on that. How he crashed my car, I ain't say nothing. Bro. Well, he did. I texted him. He said, I texted him like a week ago. I said, uh, any update? He said, oh, I'm, I'm waiting, you know, holidays and stuff, bro, you know? Mason. That was a week ago. That was, that, was, that was a week ago. Don't let me come find you, man. <laughs> He been lying from the start. Remember he yeah. told us 7.30, had us waiting. Then he said, this uh, man I'll see you tomorrow. was lying the whole entire, and I told Josh, like, Josh, he lying. Josh was like, nah. Like, yeah, he lying. Bro, didn't lie the whole time. Yeah. Sansco, we don't lie over here. Yeah, no we don't lie. To. No need to. No, no need to lie. No need to tell the fib. So, Sansco, if you're a liar, stop fibbing. AMG, the Hellcat AMG is also confirmed 100% for SEMO as well so if you don't see this car throughout this whole year i don't know why you aren't because this thing is we literally gonna take this car all across the country if you don't see it but 
If you don't see it and you go to SEMA, you will see this car 100% at SEMA with the Hellcat engine in there with a new wrap. We, got, we also planned out a wrap. This wrap is going to be one one never done before either, which I'm telling you all this now. Is the wrap is going to be insane. We're talking about technology. We're not talking about vinyl. We're talking about technology type of wrap, type of time. And we're coming on the same squad. You know what I'm saying? You know how we're doing? This thing is literally going to be legendary. But I can't wait to get back in my baby. I know it's so dirty and everything. You think you drive? Huh? Take for a drive? Right now. Oh my god, you know, I'm gonna remake that one bit. When the engine is out, bro, I can't believe you don't never see nothing. Saint Squad, <laughs> y'all, last video, last video, y'all told me y'all seen the ham sandwich video. Thank y'all for being on my side, Saint Squad. But this video, let me know if you've seen this. It was a video, it was an old school, right? It was an old school, and this dude walked up, and the hood was down, but it didn't have no engine in it. Mm -hmm. So he walked up, he was like, ah, ah, ah. He opened the hood, the dude was in there like, no, he said something like, oh, this car running weird or something. He opened the hood, the dude was in there like, oh, oh. Oh, yes, I did see you that. You seen that? Yeah, I seen that one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you gonna remake that. We gonna remake that. <laughs> I did see that. I know that little called oh ham sandwich. No, no, oh. that ham sandwich the bit from uh, yeah, okay. that one where he, yeah. he was like, ah, ah, he was like, he was like, ah, ah, this is a crackhead in there or something. Check out there. Check out there. Yeah, we gonna remake that. That's I'm remaking that. TikTok, <laughs> Instagram reels. I'm remaking that for this. But yeah, y'all, next week, that is the update on the AMG. We are taking everything out, and we are officially getting started on my Hellcat AMG, and it will be at SEMA. The wrap, we are doing technology. Stay tuned for it. Yeah, update, y'all. I cannot wait. I can't wait. I know y'all are excited for it. If you are excited for it, go down and smash the like button. I know y'all can't wait for it, because I literally can't wait. We changing the game, man. What you looking at? Was this roll cage in here before? Yeah. Really? Uh huh. Harness bar is yellow, with the seat belts. That's tough. You like that? Yeah. I didn't know that was in there. Ken, you wanna know something? Same squad. Y'all wanna know something? It's cold. It is cold <laughs> right here. Let me God. tell you. You look right here. Yeah. You see right here, Ken? Mm -hmm. I got a. I got. I got a video. Me get ahead right there. Ta da! In this car. She's sitting right here, leaned over. I got a video of me getting ahead right here. Same squad. 10K likes, I'll drop the video. Patreon. 10K. <laughs> what you say? Patreon. <laughs> 10K likes, Patreon. I'll Patreon. Set it up. <laughs> I'll set it up. $100. <laughs> Patreon. <laughs> Oh my god. 10k likes, Saint Squad. I'll drop the video in here. 10k likes, I'll do it. That's hilarious. Oh my god. Y'all know I thought about doing the setting up a Patreon though. Y'all know I have my Saint University. That didn't really work out. The dude backstabbed me, deleted the whole Discord chat. I'm sorry, I don't know. So I think I'm gonna redo it on Patreon. And um, yeah, I think I'm gonna do a Patreon. Would y'all want that? Comment down below, let me know. I'm gonna teach y'all the secrets to life. But I'm gonna tell y'all this now. I'm gonna give y'all a sneak peek right now. The number one secret is seek God and put God first. Everything will fall into play. I'm gonna teach you everything after that. So comment down below, let me know if y'all would want the Patreon. And I still gotta drop the hoodies too. That's coming soon. Yeah. But yeah, update, update on the Hellcat Swap AMG. It's gonna be fire. Look at Ronnie. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, update on that. It's going to be fire. You excited? Yeah, I'm super excited. I was so happy. I told you, when you told me it was coming back to the channel, I was excited. Yeah. yeah I'm so happy to come back. Yeah. This is my favorite car. Me too. No, nah, not, not me. Really? I just got a fire memory in here, bro. Like, this car just brings memories. You know how much I did with this car? Yeah, this is like the... Bro. I drove this car from Cali to Michigan again, but I, this time I was just by myself. It was just me and my car just together. Me and the AMG just together alone. I have so many, I got so many like good memories. Cause y'all know I'm a peaceful man. I just like my chill time and just having peace and everything. I just like, I just got some fire memories in this car, bro. I'm so happy is I didn't really get rid of it, but this car is going to be the tool to go to the next level, man. So. But I don't think you understand that you broke the mold. And what I mean by you broke the mold is, you broke them all in the sense of, like, um, Jake Paul had, like, the tin house. Mm -hmm. Remember that? That's, like, that's different. Yeah. No, that's not your everyday thing. Mm -hmm. You've seen a black kid with a freaking race car. <laughs> and that boy was hard. No face. Crazy, bro. Black man. 
You know what I'm saying? And and this race car need that. I did, but that's why. But that's why you, you ain't never seen no black kid in a race car swap. No. You ain't never seen that. This is the same squad. I'm telling y'all, I know, I understand, I've been dormant, lad, 2023, 20, I was dormant, I got a rap in the beginning of the year, I disappeared, stuck in Cali. Same squad, I'm back, and I'm back, and I'm standing on business, and I'm back, coming hard, I'm coming back, Josh Laurent, the pioneer, the technician of everything, I'm coming back for my spot, same squad. I'm coming back strong and hard. I'm doing the one and one things that you ain't never seen. I'm doing the one and one things that motivate the youth, and motivate everybody. Come on, Saint Squad, we coming back. Come on, let them know, Ken. Couldn't let them know, Ken. I'm coming. Ooh, okay, okay. I'm coming back on. The, I'm coming back, Saint Squad. I need y'all to understand. It's the takeover season. Josh Laurent comeback season. Josh Laurent back. It's the takeover season. We coming back, and we. What Josh Laurent known for? Being one of the ones. Being the one. Yeah. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What Josh Wright known for? That being that guy. And it's all God's plan. All the glory to God. Thank you, Lord, for bringing this opportunity to me. Thank you, Lord, for everything. Hallelujah. But we come back motivating the youth and letting y'all know it is what it is and how it is. Josh Wright back. Just know. And next week, we officially start on the AMG Take Everything Out. Hellcat AMG commences. But anyways, let's see what else they got in here because they got oh, a bunch of other stuff. And plus, we're getting out this room. It's cold. This is kind of fire. You want this? No. <laughs> and we got the twin turbo demon here. Can you imagine a demon with twin turbos, bro? Ain't that crazy? Shit lifting off the ground. Oh, man. Uh -huh. Hey, what's up? Hey, mom. What you doing? I'm on a call right now. You okay? Yeah, I was just going to ask if you want to go to Cracker Barrel when you get home. Go to where? Cracker Barrel. Yep, makes sense. Okay. Okay, Trey, I'm on. Let me see what I'm Okay. Um, yeah, that works. Okay, call you right back. All right, love you. Love you too. Bye. Need that. And we are leaving Performance Lab. Major shout out to Performance Lab, man. Huh? It feels good out here. It do feel, feel way better out here than in there. No fake. Yeah, it was cold in there, but look at the hurricane, y'all. The white wheels do look good, but remember y'all, remember, we have to keep the white wheels until it gets warmer out so they don't mess up when we when we repaint them. This, all of this gets redone when we do the new ride, but it's okay. I still love the Hurricane, it still look good. But right now, since I'm eating dinner later, I need some lunch. Where are you going, McDonald's? Yeah, pissed out. <laughs> pissed out, little McDonald's big stop. I would say Chick-fil-A, but I'm tired of Nordstrom's. We can go CJ. Mm-mm. <laughs> Y'all, it looked way worse out here earlier. I mean, you could tell by my car. It snowed so bad, but it's not... It's been warm enough to where the snow hasn't been able to melt. But anyways, welcome to the next day. We got... Well, what snow so bad out here, but... Yeah. Hurricane, you stay in the garage for today. For the end of this video, because right now, y'all... Well... We going up to the P.O. box. I got the P.O. box key. Uh, I'm set it right there. Don't slip and slide. But we are about to head up to the P.O. box, y'all. Because if you don't know, I have my P.O. box in the description where you guys can send me some of your brands that you want to see me wear. And when you guys hit me up, who sent me something before said, I just got a new drop. I just sent it to you. And I know it's been a couple other of you guys who probably sent me stuff also. So it's about time we head to the P.O. box and see what y'all got, man. I love doing these P.O. box unboxings. Like I said, link in the description. I wear a small or medium and stuff. And my shoe size is a 9 if you want to send me anything. And I think you guys like the unboxing also. So, yeah. We finna go get some clothes. Been this turn. Hit the Apex though. You know what I'm saying? Race car in the baby MG. You feel me? Then we just gonna drive up. We made it to the post office, by the way. See what they got for me today. I don't never pull in. I don't, be, I don't be knowing if I'm close to the curb or not. We're just going to guess. Y'all, them Timmy holes mess me up. I got sprinkles stuck in my seat, dude. Like, that, them, the Timmy holes mess me up off the sprinkles, bro. Now the sprinkles stuck in my seat. How do you get this off? But, yeah, we'd be right. But anyways, y'all, you look back here, right? You see that? Oh, don't worry. More Timmy holes back there, bro. I'm lucky done with Tim Hortons. They killing me, stupid radar. But anyways, y'all, uh, yeah, let's see what y'all got me. 
and we got two big packages look at this car another package and then somebody sent me a car how thoughtful all right we've bought to go back home we finna unbox these packages because y'all see saint squad y'all drip came in so new drip alert you know what i'm saying new drip alert thank y'all for sending me stuff man i appreciate y'all all right let's go unbox and we made it back to the crib bo now we got these packages from y'all that we bought to take out thank you saint squad for everything y'all do for me man thank y'all so we got three we got the big boy the one i'm excited for but i already know what it is so i'm gonna show y'all we might do that one first then we got the second smallest and then we have the car for last because sometimes the smallest things may be the biggest impact so we're gonna do the car for last so big one first i've been excited about this because this junk is hard and this is actually saint squad brand called insecure it's one of the hoodies he sent me two of them before y'all really like the hoodies too but he just dropped a whole new fit so saint squad shout out to saint squad shout out to y'all getting me right you know what i'm saying fit ain't nothing today because you know it's chill days it was snowing outside you know what i'm saying so it's just regular first Need that. Need that. The packaging is so crazy. Same squad, y'all. Woo! So we got hoodie and a zip up this time. God dang, that's hard. God dang. So yeah, hoodie, hoodie and a zip up with the you know what I'm saying, the sand on the back. Yeah, that's hard. That hoodie is five. Little cards. Thank you for shopping with insecure nothing in the world is more common than unsuccessful people with talent Ooh, that's deep oh snap oh snap this is what i've been wanting this this is what i've been wanting so we got the other hoodie so zip up like this got that zip up silk hood it's crazy i can put my hoodie on with my fresh you know hair then the back this back is hard yeah this hard for so sure. It's hard for sure. So we got that hoodie. And then. Then we got the flare pants on the. Yeah! Yeah! Need it. These, these ones is hard. These is hard. Say squat. Y'all see me in this every video. Don't say nothing. Do not judge. Every video. Be like, ugh, your meat stank. You got the same pants on for the whole week. I'm, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Get how you live. You feel me? Woo, that's hard. Yeah, that's hard. Fast, fashionably healing. That's what they say on the pants. That is hard. Shout out to y'all, Saint Squad. Thank y'all for sending me stuff. Their brand is called this, and I believe the Instagram is like, you could just put insecure on there also. You should be able to find it. But yeah, shout out to them, man. Like, I really do appreciate it. That is hard. That is hard. Shout out to them if y'all want to cop something. Same squad, we family support each other, man. That that's hard. That's hard. I love y'all clothes, man. Y'all really, y'all be killing the game. Next package. Package. Woo. Oh, another zip up hoodie. Let me find out my spring drip gonna be zip up hoodies now. Let me find out. Y'all know I love black clothes. Oh. Little paper back there. Little paper back. Let me find. Yeah. Oh, snap. This is crazy. You see the arm sleeves. You see that? And it's like that little crop fit on the hoodie. And then you got the. Look at the back. Look at the back. Yeah. God. That's hard. That's hard. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's hard. Woo. We don't have. What does it say? Stay down. It say stay down on the front and then money, money, something. I don't know. But Saint Squad, can y'all read that? I'm sorry if I can't read that, but if y'all do want the hoodie, man, shout out to Saint Squad for sending this to me. <sighs> yeah, actually, I did a uh, promo on this on my um, Instagram story. Stay tuned to my Instagram, Justin Mark with two T's. I'm gonna find out again. 
But yeah, I did a promo on my Instagram, so y'all can cop this hoodie. This is hard, and I never had a hoodie. Like, I always want a bake hoodie, just because it's zipped up all the way up top. I never had a hoodie that zipped up all the way to the top. So yeah, that's... Let me find out. My spring drip finna be straight zip-up hoodies. Killing a game, killing a game. Last but not least, we have the card. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Josh Laurent, God blessed in Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. Then this note. Why well, say help on here? Open this. <laughs> he put, can you help me, G? Open this on camera. <laughs> All right. Dear Josh Laurent, I'm a subscriber. I've been watching your videos seen since day one. I like your videos. Can you shout out my YouTube name? It is. It is. Mmm. Do he get a free shout out? He did do the most to send me a Christmas and New Year's card. So he had to literally go out, go out to CVS, pick up a Christmas card, and bring it and bring it and say, "Can you give me a shout out?" My YouTube name is Say Squad. Do he deserve a shout out? Comment down below. Let me. Know. If y'all do know, I charge a thousand for an in video shout out. Do he deserve this right now? Comment down below and let me know, Saint Squad. His YouTube name is John the... I opened it on camera, champ. Appreciate the leather. Well, for you asking for a shout out. I appreciate the card though, really do. Thank you for taking the time out today for sending me this card. But anyway, Saint Squad, that is all we got. One more thing, let me put y'all on real quick. Let me, let me put y'all on real quick. This is the best sweet tea. I have to stop at the store because I'm about to eat some Cracker Barrel leftovers. This is the best sweet tea you will ever have in your entire life, Saint Squad. If you are in the South and the Midwest, I don't know if they have this on the East Coast. They might. They for sure don't have it in Cali. We, we figured that out. Best sweet tea ever. I'm putting y'all on free game, Saint Squad. If y'all get these, tag me on in Instagram story. I'm going to like it. Best sweet tea ever. Go try it. You got to get the extra sweet. Gold Peak Extra Sweet. They do not sponsor me. Gold Peak do need to sponsor me off this, though. Tell Gold Peak to sponsor me. But the best sweet tea you can ever have in your entire life, make sure you go get this at, at the gas station. If you can, get it. Tag me. I'll put y'all on. Free game. Josh Laurent special. But anyways, y'all, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, go down and smash that like button. Then subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any more bangers. I'm about to get my merch going. I'm gonna, sell, I'm gonna only sell like five hoodies or something, bro. I don't think, like, honestly, Saint Squad, if we being honest, like, yeah, my hoodies is cool that I wanna drop, but I don't think, like, a lot of y'all really gonna cop them how y'all say y'all are, man. Like, I just don't, like, I don't know if I don't have any, like, faith in the brand or whatever, but, yeah, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is, but I'm gonna go make, like, a few hoodies tomorrow, so I'm gonna take y'all along with me and show y'all how to start your own clothing brand, actually, because it's pretty simple. If you do want to start on the simple side, then you can go to advanced, like get an advanced, like embroidered stuff and like, and, and the fuzzy stuff on there and everything. I don't know how to do that yet. Thanks why y'all got it. But yeah, like I don't think y'all gonna cop my merch like that for real. You feel me? So I'm just gonna make a few things. We're gonna do that tomorrow. So I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video because I'm gonna teach y'all how to start a flow brand. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video, Saint Squad. I'm about to go eat some leftovers. Hope you enjoyed your dinner this video. And yeah, I'm gonna catch you on the next one. Hoodies will be dropping in the next video also, so stay tuned for that. The hoodies, Saint Hoodies, the memorial to the Hurricane Wrap, even though we just unwrapped it, will be dropping in the next video. So stay tuned. I'm gonna show y'all how to do it. I'm gonna catch you on the next one. Peace.